when you get an electric trike from electrictrike.com, we like to set it up to fit you out of the box. In this video, we're going to talk about fitting the recumbent trikes to you. On the recumbent trikes, we use the X seam measurement, which takes into account the shape of your body and the seat angle you'll be sitting at. On upright trikes, like the Sun Traditional, we'll be using your inseam measurement instead. And that measurement, the inseam for the Sun Traditional, for instance, is from the floor up your leg there. Uh, it's the same measurement that you'll see on the back of your pants uh, printed on a tag sewn into your pants as the inseam measurement. But for the recumbents, we'll want the X seam, and that measurement is like this. If you sit on the ground, it's from the tip of your feet all the way back to the back of your bottom as you sit on a recumbent angle like you have on the seat of a recumbent trike. There's a couple ways you can do this. One way is to take a sturdy board like a piece of plywood or an ironing board and lean it against the wall and then you'll sit down on the floor with your shoes on up against the board and you'll lean back against it. Now all of the recumbent trikes have adjustable seats. You can adjust the seat back angle here and after you get the trike it's easy to adjust the leg length on the trike. So if you don't get the measurement quite right, it's no big deal because you can dial it in to suit your personal preference by moving it a couple inches either way. We just want to get into the ballpark so that when you get the trike, you can hop on and try it out and then start to tweak it to your preference a little bit later. So you can take this angle, but you may adjust the seat to be a little more upright or to lean back a little farther. It's no big deal. But you'll have an assistant Pull the tape measure out to the tip of your shoes, all the way back here to the front of the board or the back of your bottom. And that will be your X seam, this length along your leg to the back of your bottom as you're sitting back at an angle. A lot of our customers might not be as comfortable getting all the way down on the floor and then getting back up again to take that measurement. So you can also do this in a reclining chair. Find a comfortable chair that you can tilt back to a good angle to mimic the bike and then put your feet up on the chair's footrest or on a stool and then you'll measure again having an assistant pull the tape measure from the bottom of your feet all the way back to the back of your bottom or the front of the chair there. And so this will be your X seam as well. The last thing you can do is you can take this measurement uh, sitting on your bed. So you can sit back against the headboard of the bed, pile some pillows up behind your back to lean against comfortably at an angle, and then have an assistant measure from the bottom of your feet to the front of the pillows or the back of your bottom. If you're not sure about this measurement, don't worry too much because again the bike is adjustable after you get it. We're just getting it set up for you as close as we can ahead of time. And uh, if you have trouble taking the measurement, you can always choose the option that says, I'm not sure uh, when you're adding the product to your cart. And then we can call you after we get your order, or you can call us up and we can discuss how to take the measurement or alternatives in order to help you out. So thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.